One of the key statements made at the recent China International Medical Equipment Fair that ended last weekend was that large international medical device makers will target second and third tier cities in China to sell their devices. According to new medical reforms, $135.56 billion will be invested into the primary care market and over 750 million Chinese people will join the primary care system. Under such a policy, international medical giants such as GE Healthcare and Medtronic Incorporated, used to providing high-end medical devices in large cities, are planning to sink their brand channels into the second and third tier cities and even into rural areas in China. Duan Xiaoyin, president and CEO of GE Healthcare China, said that the medical products of GE sold in small cities in rural China used to bring less than 20 percent of the total sales of GE in China. We hope this proportion can increase to 50 percent in three to five years. It was reported that GE would issue over 40 new products in three years, 70 percent of which would be targeted at primary care market. According to Duan, GE has created new financial channels for small market facilities to purchase higher medical technology devices. Another of the world's medical device giants, Medtronic, announced in September the purchase of China Kanghui Holdings for about $755 million. Not including Kanghui's cash flow, Kanghui Holdings has a strong sales network in second and third tier cities, while at the moment products of Medtronic have been mostly sold to large hospitals in first tier cities. Wu Wenong, director of public relations at Medtronic China, said it was the connection that Kang Hui had in the second and third tier cities that attracted Medtronic. Medtronic needed that assistance to reach those markets. Primary care is still developing in the smaller cities in China. This move forward by these medical device makers will make a win-win situation. The smaller hospitals and clinics will improve medical care and train medical staff on these devices, while the international companies will profit by the additional sales.